What's up guys, J.R. Raymond back again, coming to you from Classic Lanes in Rochester Hills, Michigan, home of MRB Classic Pro Shop, where Mason Brantley is the operator here. Today, I'm gonna to bring you the new 900 Global Money Badger, the pearlized one, the green one. We just looked at the black one, the tour version of that ball, which I was really impressed with. So we're gonna take a look at the green one and we're gonna kind of compare the two a little bit. So stay tuned. All right, here we go. I got the new Money Badger here. We're gonna kind of show you this here, same layout, just a normal, uh, it ended up being, what was it? 65 by four and a half by 35. And you can see I got the black one here. It is the same layout, same exact thing, mass bias in the same spot. So we'll start with the green one. Let you guys kind of see, we're gonna do the same thing, start in the track area. Throw a few shots with the green one, throw a few shots with, with the black one. You guys can kind of take a gander. Ah, this one's definitely a lot cleaner than I remember from the black one. So that's good, I mean, that's the idea. And this is with, that was with me trying to roll it, stay straighter. So I may be able to get my hand around it a pinch from there, get it to go through the pins. This has a pretty good shot. Let's see what I can do here. Hand around it a little. Yeah, much better there. So I'm finished down lane, so that's good. Move a little bit left with it. Actually, I'll throw the black one in that zone so you guys can kind of see a difference. This time I am on a fresh pattern. This is a fresh 42 foot league pattern. So you can, uh, it's gonna see a little bit different than what it was when it was on that beat up pattern before. All right, I'm gonna stand in the same spot. Try to roll it. So you can see the black one pick up quite a bit sooner. And that was with my rolly hand position. That wasn't the around it. So now I'll go around it a little bit and it should hook through the face. Because the black one should be quite a bit more than the green one. Shouldn't, shouldn't say quite a bit more. I mean, they're the same layout. You're going to see a lot of the similarities, but the cover stock is the big difference. So I'll get around it a little bit here now. Oh, I missed right. Yeah. And either way, you can see it definitely overreact compared to the green one. So much different ball reaction. All right, so you saw that. So in order to get there, I'm gonna move a few left. I'm gonna make the adjustment that I feel like I need to make to get to the pocket with this one versus the green one. So now we'll move left. We're gonna go here. Ah, so that was pretty good. I thought it was okay. Couldn't quite get the 10 out, but I'll try and go back to the green one now. So you can see the difference. go to that same spot where I just threw the black one. Yeah, that one, I mean, that, the green one's obviously much more down lane. The black one's a little earlier and smoother because that was almost identical to the black one and it still found its way back and stronger so that was actually really impressive. I like that a lot. And this ball's flaring quite a bit. Oil rings on this are pretty large, which for a four and a half inch layout, that's not normal for me. All right, we're gonna keep going left. Let's 
pretty good shot. Yeah, really delaying there, really delaying. I mean, I really like the shape of this ball though. So I already told you, I'm adding the black one to the bag because it is a strong ball that I like the, the, I like the motion. It's a little smoother. I'll go a few more left. See if I can't soften up just a little bit, slow down a pinch, get the ball to go through the pins. Miss right, slow down, miss right, still got there. That's a good sign. Let's try and throw one a little bit better. Because that was not very good. But that's all right. Let's try again. A few more left, slow down. Much better, much better. Still kind of kind of lazy on that six pin getting the 10 out. So let me see what happens with the black one now. If I go in that same area with the black one, what's it gonna do? I'm gonna try and stay slow still. Hand around it a little bit. It's a little right. Yeah. All right, so the green one from there hooked. The green one saw the friction and went left. This one blended it a little bit more. Probably should have practiced a little bit this weekend because I'm throwing it everywhere. Let's try that again. Try it with the black one again. It's pretty good. Yeah, there you go. So that one really picked up, went through the pins really well. So both of these are fairly strong down lane. I don't see either one of them as being an early rolling ball. They're definitely clean. Go back to the green one for a couple more shots. And about four more left. That's got a hook. Yeah, that was really cool. That was really good. Definitely plenty of down lane motion. The green one doesn't read the middle lane like the black one does. So these two are gonna complement each other really well. The black one reads the middle of the lane really, really good. The green one's a little bit cleaner through there. Doesn't quite get, doesn't quite pick up as much. So you gotta really go around it. that hook yeah see so if you if anybody remembers the last video with the black money badger tour I said that it reminds me of the the eruption pro blue but it was a little stronger this ball right here is an eruption pro blue for me the green one it's the same strength so that gives me that that I mean maybe I shouldn't say that it's an eruption pro blue but it's a little bit stronger down lane Whereas the black one is the same as an Eruption Pro Blue, but it's a little stronger earlier. So if that makes any sense. Keep going left. Get in front of the cap now a little bit. See if we can get her to come around the corner. It's pretty good. Ooh. Definitely came around the corner. So she likes to be slow and steep in the front. Throw the black one from there. See if I can get the black one to go through the pins from there. Let's 
Let's see what we got. Money Badger Tour. Yeah, almost identical except that one, black one I just read sooner. That's pretty much all the difference was there. Wasn't a huge difference, but it's enough to see two different shapes. All right, one couple, few more shots with the green one, since this is the video for the green one. I'm gonna go straighter. Remember when I flat tend in the beginning, going straighter, I'm gonna try to go even straighter than that and get the ball to go through the pins. So the cleaner cover will let me go straighter like that. Or if you saw, if you remember in the other video with the black one, the black one wanted to hook way too fast. Granted, it was a beat up pattern. So here, let me throw the black one in that same spot. And you can see the difference. How this one just will overhook in that spot. It should overhook in that spot anyway. So that one crosses over and goes Brooklyn. The green one pushes through there fairly well and strikes. So, so you can see, you know, what the difference is between the green one and the black one. But these money badgers are definitely bowling balls that are going to be in my bag. Uh, they remind me too much of a lot of the really good bowling balls that I like. Um, so um, for me, the black one was a little bit earlier. Uh, a little bit smoother, whereas the green one was cleaner and stronger down lane. Obviously, that's the way it should be because the green one is more pearlized and a shinier cover. Then the black one is a little bit smoother, you know, duller cover. cover. So uh, make sure to head over to BowlerX.com and get yours today. There's going to be a link in the description. You're going to be able to see everything you need in there. Um, but make sure to head over there, order your badgers. Both of these badgers are available today at BowlerX.com. I hope you enjoyed this. Uh, and if you have any questions, please make sure to comment below and hit that like and share this video. And until next time, guys, we'll see you later.